guys, it's Amanda. Um, so today I'm gonna be showing you a prom hair, makeup, and dress because I thought that this would help. And also, I designed this dress that I'm wearing and showing in the video um, with real style. So I came up with the idea and I think that's pretty awesome. You guys can go buy it and wear it to your prom if it's not too late. There's only a limited amount of these dresses and it's only sold for a limited amount of time. It ships on May 20th. So make sure you guys go get this before there's no more left. You could also buy the necklace and makeup that I used. I didn't use any of the eyeshadows because I'm gonna do a different tutorial later with that. But the, the blush and the lipstick that I used, you can also buy on the Real Style website. It was so fun going through the whole design process of this, so I'm excited to show you it and see who picks up some of the stuff. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get started. I'm starting off the makeup with a clean face and I'm gonna do my eyes first. So first I'm gonna prime with Urban Decay Primer Potion cause you don't want it sweating off or creasing when you're dancing and having fun at prom. So I'm just doing all of this. Then I'm gonna take a base color. So anything that kinda blends in with your skin tone, just use that to set the, um, the primer because we're gonna be using a black eyeshadow. And as you can tell here, um, the black eyeshadows don't really go on that smoothly just like most black eyeshadows do this so you're gonna have to like pack on a lot and really work with it but the good thing about this look is that it doesn't have to be perfect so you can't you don't have to worry too much so I'm just gonna do that um, on both of my lids not worrying about it being too perfect because we're gonna blend like crazy I'm taking a brown color that you can use to like put in your crease I'm using that here and just blending out the edges a ton you just want to blend 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 that is the most important step in this look because this this look is super super simple basically just two eyeshadows you're using so just blending a lot will make it um, look like an awesome smoky eye and it's really easy to do so I'm just gonna keep doing that and then come back Now when you're done, you're just gonna bring those colors to your lower lash line so it's all bounced out and smoky all over. So you're just gonna mix the black and the brown together to match the bottom, match the top actually. <laughs> then you're gonna line your waterline with black eyeliner so it keeps the smoky look going on and try not to pull too hard on your eyes but you know, it's kinda necessary a little bit to do that. Then I'm taking highbrow from Benefit which I love. I just pop this in the inner corner and underneath my eyebrows and this gives a perfect highlight and it's just super super easy to do so that is awesome then I'm going to curl my eyelashes you can use fake eyelashes if you want because um, that's it's like a fancy occasion I would definitely use fake eyelashes but for this look I'm just gonna use um, mascara I'm using the they're real from benefit and just put it on my lashes. They actually looked pretty good today, so that's why I skipped out on the fake eyelashes. To transform your look, you gotta fill in your eyebrows and make them on fleek, so I'm just like combing them in one direction and then using this Anastasia Brow, brow Wiz um, to fill it in. I'm just kinda like making a better shape of my eyebrows and then filling it all in as best as I can. I'm not perfect at it, I know that, but I just try my best and I kind of just follow how my eyebrow already goes, but just fills it in because it, there's like pieces that I'm missing in my eyebrow, you know? Now that you're done with your eyebrows, uh, you're gonna move on. This is the final eye and eyebrow look. I'm gonna do my foundation and come back to you. Ta-da, there it is. Then I'm gonna contour. I always contour, I love bronzer. So this is the Too Faced Chocolate Bronzer. And I'm just putting this in my cheekbones and like on my temple and blend it down your neck too so you don't have a line of foundation. That would be bad, so bad. Make sure you do that. For blush, I'm using one that you can get from, the, from my Real Style page. 
and it's the color cloud it's super super pretty and it goes awesome with this look so i'm just putting that on my cheeks and it gives it a little bit more color and flush flesh to your flesh flush something like that to your face then i'm taking the man steel prom collection lipstick in hip so you can also get that there and i'm just putting this on my lips and it finishes off the look perfectly Ta-da! Your face is prom ready. So simple, but it's an awesome, dramatic, special occasion look. Now we're going to move on to the hair. So I'm doing a little twist on something that I normally do. I'm just starting out with curls. You can do that, and even with your hair straight, it would look really cool. I'm kind of sectioning off this top part of my head, and then grabbing a little piece of hair and starting to french braid this so you can just watch what i'm doing um it's kind of one of those things you just have to learn how to do um like through practicing so you're just grabbing a piece of hair each time you are braiding it into um you know you cross one over and you cross the other one over that's how you normally braid but french braiding you pick up more hair for each cross so it goes all the way back to your head um, yeah, so I'm just braiding it all the way back like that. Once you've braided enough, I'm just going to grab more hair from the back of my head so it's like a thicker chunk of hair. And I'm going to tie it off with a rubber band so it's still, it's like a half up, half down look that I do a lot but it's a little bit fancier and different because we have the braid in there and it's edgy it's an edgy hairstyle definitely for prom but it goes with the dress and the makeup look for sure so that's the final look um, you can also do this like for a non edgy look too um, it could go both ways so here is a dress that I designed I think it's so cute it's definitely edgy and different but if you're gonna be wearing this then you're definitely gonna turn heads that is a good thing I'd say um, yeah, it's actually two-piece, so not technically a dress, but it's still a prom dress. Uh, base, yeah, you can see what it looks like. That's what it looks like. I think it's cute. And then the necklace can also get there. There's a little knot and a lot of detail going on. That's the look. Hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks for watching. Bye. Mwah.